Hi, this is Rockin' Robin, and today we are going to Target stores. We want to see what is new. I'm mostly going to look at clothing, but I'm going to look at some other things as well. So you stay with us and come shop with me. Okay, so let's take a walk through Target. I'm really excited because I haven't been in here for the new year and I want to see what they have. I always start on the right side where they have some cheaper items, some items that you wouldn't find or you wouldn't be looking for. And you never know what you're going to find and they're usually something very cute. So let's see. Saw some little Valentine's Day things. Nothing too excited, but I always know that these are cute. I especially look in this area for stocking stuffers, but you never know what you're going to find. And I want to just take a quick peek of that before I go to the clothes. So let's see what else I find. Oh, these were very cute. I like those, but I certainly don't need any more of those. So I headed to the clothes. First thing I found was bathing suits. Bathing suits were big. And I love the colors. And these were two pieces over here. Very nice. A little too skinny for me. So I just kept walking along, but I wanted to show you some of the items that they did have and some of the colors. I did find a few bathing suits that I thought were quite cute. The prices are not too bad, $32. Depends what you're looking for. I think that was just for the top. So for me, that's a little high, but it depends. I like to get the whole outfit in one. And I didn't see that the bottoms were included. Now I kind of like some of these a little bit better. I like more color and patterns than just plain. It all depends on your style. But I did find some that were one piece and I found some tops that were bigger. I'm a little on the big side, so I'm always looking for stuff that's a little bigger and will cover that up. I thought those were a neat pattern. I don't know if I would like them because of the straps, but Otherwise, they were kind of interesting and kind of unique. There's the price. Not so bad there. And then black always is slimming, but it's kind of boring. I really liked this one right here that I look at. I really liked it. I wish it wasn't straps. If it had been something more sturdy, I think I would have bought it. But those are like my colors. I couldn't find a price at first. I was looking, and even this one, I like the one in back too. But I couldn't find a price, but then, lo and behold, I found it. There you go. Now back to uh, some for skinnier people, or people who really want to wear a two-piece. Very, very pretty. I think uh, 2022 is going to be bright colors and really nice patterns. Now over here, I found some uh, more like pajama tops and um, outfits like that. There's a price. Nah, didn't stand out for me. I like just sleeping in a t-shirt and shorts. So, you know, it all depends what your style is. And I found some walking. There's some lingerie and here's some walking clothes. I did like that. And I loved those pants. So, believe it or not, I did purchase those. I did purchase those shorts. I'm going to use them even as a bathing suit bottom. Um, but it's a, apparently it's walking. It's great for uh, walking shorts. And I looked for several pairs over here to see what else we had. And something in the men's department caught my eye. These are all Margaritaville. They're all men's, but I, I, I really like uh, the style. I live in Florida, and that style is always good for me. And I like those. Polos were really nice. They were also Margaritaville. And if you've ever been to uh, Margaritaville or you like the song, you'll understand the style. We have a Margaritaville here, and we live very close to where the man who wrote Margaritaville lives. So, you know, very common here in Florida. Now, over here, I went back and was looking at some of the pants because those are also men's, and guess what? They were Margaritaville. Of course, I didn't buy any for me, but I thought they were kind of cool if that is your style. I didn't realize that they had them exclusively at Target. Now, I went back to the shoes. I went to the women's shoes. I wanted to take a look. 
I was mostly looking for the flip-flops. See what they had in summer. I like something that covers my toes though, and I didn't find any, but I did see that they had quite a variety for summer, and some of them looked pretty interesting. But again, it was all very colorful. Um, I didn't think that they were high priced. Look at that style. Well, it'd be kind of neat, but I didn't like the toes. Very, very colorful. And if you like some more basics, here they have them. I'm going to bring you all the way down and then I'll bring you back for a second look just in case you missed anything. Great sandals that you could wear every day, even probably to work or even just casuals. And then let's take a walk back just in case. Some stuff for the beach if you're getting ready, thinking about where you're going to go on vacation. Maybe going to a nice warm spot this year. You've got to start thinking about summer clothes and some nice shoes. See what we can find over here. Yep, this is where we started. And on my way out, I also found some of this. Uh, Black History Month. Celebrate Black History Month 2022. And this was a whole collection. I had not seen a collection like this, so I thought this was kind of unique, and I didn't want to pass it by. I want to show you a little bit of everything in this area. And they had some adult and some children items. Very nice. So, that was great. Target was very full of good items. So there's a lot of new items up for 2022. It's definitely worth making a trip and visiting the store and seeing what you like. Bathing suits, new shoes, new lingerie, you name it, even for women and for men. Well, thank you so much for watching my video. Please remember to subscribe, hit the bell, and give us a big thumbs up.